There's a video on searching for stroke order. We'll use this uh, kanji for the tan in tanjobi to be born as an example. Um, so there are uh, three basic ways that we could look at this. Let's look, um, and that you can access them all from our Blackboard page. The easiest way is through kakijin, kakijin, which if you already know the reading of the stroke, you can go to this page up here and just type, for example, in Japanese, tanjoubi. Um, we'll get rid of those first two and hit return, and it'll give us an animation in order of how to write the tan and tanjoubi. Uh, if you don't like writing in Japanese, typing in Japanese, you can go to the second one, this marine bat, um, and start here where you just can go by pronunciation or by number of strokes. So for tan, for tanjobi, whoa. we'll click on tan, and here we find this, and we can even download or save this if we want to. And it gives us the, the stroke order movie that you actually saw in the opening screen of this. But if you don't know how to pronounce the character, you can use either the uh, Jisho or tangu, Tangorin in order to look up the strokes in this. So we'll go to radicals. Radical is a part of the kanji. And we note that the, these are the number of strokes, one, two, three, four, five for the radical. And so we note that the left side looks like this. And we can search from around here. We know that it has 15 strokes, but it's easier if we add one more element from the, the character, like this is in there. Nope, it's the only one left. And so we can search for this. Uh, and then click on the kanji itself over here to the right side. And you either you have both a movie that shows you how to draw it, as well as this sliding thing that gives you the stroke order how to write. So again, to repeat, you can use these stroke order links, or you can use Jisho or Tangorin to find out the stroke order.